better for this. Especially because with the 2x experience, if you ever end up retiring, I guess my guys are not necessarily going to be retired, but... Uh, yeah, let's bring Vector. I thought Vector did a fine job. And then we had another... Uh, let's see. Aaron? Yeah, let's bring Aaron. Equipment. Double perilous core. Nah, bring a sponge down. Yeah, I'm not sure what Merida is. Do we want Vector? Actually, no. We want we want Joshua because we're on a we're on, we're power leveling our relics. So yeah, let's do that instead. Twenty one HP. It's pretty good. And we've got and then we've got one from each of our houses too, which is pretty good. Free throw and uh, uh, I'd rather have the aerodynamic flasks. Do that instead. Okay, here we go. Let's go, team. Is Lactulum? There's a stillness to the air right before battle. Lactulum. Like the world is taking a deep breath. Sure. Yeah, I don't know off the top They're of my head. The wind out of them. We're going to keep going clockwise. That's worked for us in the past, so let's go ahead and do it. Hug the wall. And of course, my caper jack is just like, yeah, I'll just hang out by the explosive bushes. No problem. I don't know, is my game getting stuck? Or are there just that many enemies? Oh, oh, there we go. Uh oh. We have the uh, doubly powerful bulwarks to deal with now, guys. That's not good. Mm. That's actually pretty good, that aerodynamic flasks nonsense. That's pretty good, actually. Look at that. Let's try it. Ah, we missed. We still got a bunch of damage on the guy, though. Let's go ahead and move here. Shoot the perilous core and do a damage. Just so bad. Ugh. Do I have anyone else? Ah, oh, that was a mistake. I should have shot that thing again. My day's been fine, Agent. How about yours? Whoa, hello. That's good to know. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, I 
think we need to finish off this guy to get some life back on our dude. Um, let's try attacking from here. There we go. Uh-oh. We've got another one. Oh, no, no. I'm gonna have to melee with you. That's stupid. Actually, no. I can throw a precision flask. Let's do that. You're making pickles? Sounds good. I bought a bunch of vegetables today. I was gonna do stir fry for dinner. Pinky. Cool. Yeah, I think you guys might be right. I think I might need to invest in the armor next. After the Vitalibans. Anybody else? Nope, don't see anybody. Okay, um, yeah, let's just group up on the other side of this guy. Sounds good though. Put some pickles. Sounds like a good plan to me. Aha! There's a seed. Nah, uh, just regular stir fry probably. That was not in the same country, guy. What are you doing? So let's see, I got some onions, peppers, jalapeno pepper, um, what else did I get? Uh, I got some carrots, it'll be good. There's something else too, wasn't there? I don't really like pineapple that much, so, so no, it was not pineapple stir fry. This is gonna hurt. Ouch. Hmm. I wonder, it's probably, actually, you know what, guys? It's probably better for me to run this way, get closer to my team and further from the other guys. Whoa, hello. Wait, does this guy not have a sponge shell equipped? Oh, he doesn't. Ah, shoot. You're not a fan of jalapeno peppers. What's your problem? That's actually pretty good. This artillery is actually really, really sweet. Okay, um... charge down there. I get crushed, though. Next turn. Uh, yeah, let's just get up. We need to get our team up as close as possible, I think. Uh, without subjecting them to being uh, hit, like, having multiple hits hit us. Actually, I think we should throw this precision flask. It's a low probability shot, but, um, yeah. I think that's the right move, though. Because these guys will kill us next turn otherwise. Here? Yeah, these guys I don't think can... Yeah, these ruptures should not be a problem, but we have three cradles that were... Oh, hello, that guy might be an issue. But these uh, cradles are definitely a problem. 
<laughs> That's kind of funny. He's gonna blow up now. Oh no, so am I. That's not good. I don't really like pickles. It's one of the few things that I'll tell people not to put on my sandwiches, actually. Oof. Pickles OP. Okay, so what's the most important thing to get rid of this round? I think, uh, let's go here and then charge into this dude and see if we can get a stun on these two guys and give us another turn. Is that right? Let's go here. Oh, are you kidding me, guy? No! Yeah, so those guys should be stunned for a turn. Okay, uh, let's see, I think, shoot these guys, no, this guy, it's such a low probability shot. So why is this so low, is it, because, do they have extra evasion? Wow, okay, so advanced ruptures have 35% evasion, guys, I did not know that. But not enough, apparently. So, good to note. Throw another precision flask. It's not bad there. Shoot Perilous Core. Let's just shoot him. Higher percent. I don't think that's the right move, actually. I think instead it's better for me to use my free throw on this guy. Let's try that. Free throw. Yeah, let's do that instead. Send them back to that sludge if you poke holes sink. in the cucumber, you can speed up the pickling process. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I just, I'm not a pickle guy. Throw the perilous core. There we go. So we've got the armor corrosion going there. Uh, right. I think shoot him. Let's slash this other one with Joshua blood. Rapid pickle, you unlock it as you level up. Another notch. Maybe. I think my hunter's gonna die, guys. You're a level 5 vegan. No! Ugh, I'm getting sick of that guy. That was a joke. Um, let's see. It would be nice to know where um, where that second one is. Yeah. Oh, that's too bad. <laughs> it's like the one time it would be useful to have a. Oh, wait, I can throw the Perilous Core, guys. 8 of 10 guardian gardening. I think we're going to die. That's okay. It's better for me just to slash them, though. Yeah, that's better. So blood, yeah, let's... Actually, no, let's wait. Yeah, well, your, your flask is not going to be able to kill both of them, but if we move you closer... Now we can't see that other guy at all, really. What shenanigans is this? <laughs> so annoying. Oh, we're about to get crushed, guys.
Oh, there's still another one too. Oh. Yeah, see, this is this is the problem I, I have with Alchemist, right? Even though these guys are close together, I still can't hit both of them in the same flask. Um, that's not right throw. Kill that guy. Kill this guy, I think. Blood. Um. Yeah, let's kill this guy. So the reason why I did that is that it's there's a pretty good chance people are going to die this next turn, um, and so it's better for me to just make sure that we do as much damage as possible to these other guys. Uh, let's see, let's kill this dude. Let's hit him from the opposite side, though. We're probably going to lose two guys this next turn, would be my guess. Make that three guys, because <laughs> we couldn't. We failed that hit. Uh, let's see. Um. We want to just get as much damage as possible. Oh, Perilous Core for the win, maybe. That's actually pretty good. Let's do that. There's still a good chance we lose two guys this turn. Though. Or at least one. Oh, never mind, maybe two. No! Splat. That was extremely lucky. Okay, we need to shut down... Let's see here. Oh, blood, you're not a thingy. I keep forgetting. I keep thinking he has the hack and slash. Because he... He had the other ability. Um, let's see here. So I think our priority this turn is to get damage on that bulwark, I think. Most valuable coach? Hmm. Maybe. Six to ten, really? Oh, gross. Uh, let's see here. If we throw the perilous core. If we throw a precision flask, there's a chance we'll just kill him outright. There's also a chance that we'll just miss. Oh no! So close. Uh, right. Let's get you... Actually, Blood, let's just have you take out the seed and get some life back. Okay. So now you, our other hunter, can come down to here, I think. It's the best spot. Shoot the Perilous Core. No. Really? Still only a 70% chance? That's no good. Yay! Two damage, critical hit. Right. Okay, Devoe. Put your damage in. Let's see here. Uh, yes. So Devoe will probably die this turn, maybe? If this guy decides to shoot. That was not nice. Ooh. That could have gone better. That's okay, though. Mm. Let's get some life back. Or not, because I don't have the uh, thing equipped. Oops. Ah, well. Right. 
That's still an option. Um, let's go ahead and just try to crush him with an explosive blast. Nope. Uh, Blood's doing okay. He's about half life. That's good. So now he's going to take 10. Uh, he's going to die. He's going to die next turn. Oh yeah, definitely. These these advanced bulwarks are obnoxious. Oh, there are three of them? Oh no, this is so bad, guys. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's go ahead and free throw. Okay, we have to get pretty lucky here. Where did that other one go? What the heck? It must be hiding like right in that corner. That's not very useful. Uh, let's see. I can't stealth this guy. Let's see. How about... Can you do anything useful with you? I don't think so. I still can't see him. Ah, that's really annoying. Yeah, they're all they're all about to die. Can't even throw like so I know he's hiding right here and I can't throw the perilous core over there. Oh, it's so useless, guys. I'm sorry. It's just it's terrible. Uh, it's so bad. Oh, freaking thing. Um, might as well shoot this guy. There's there's no reason to run around. Here. As far as I can tell. Here. Move someplace so we can't get a double shot off on my guys, I guess. No, there's not really much point. Oh, there he is. So there's one here. Oh, hello. How are you doing today, Mr. Bulwark? So this one we can kill, probably. No! We'll make it through this. Okay. So there's one just chilling behind us, so we need to deal with him. And then there's this guy right in our face. Let's see, uh, let's take, so we need to kill this one. Um, you don't have your free throw up. Throw the perilous core. Let's see, could kill it. Could do some damage, that's not bad. The other option is slash this guy you can't move anywhere else yeah so I think I think Joshua should just try to slash this one first just to get damage on it good job okay so now to shoot perilous core yeah so the you so when you shoot it you have to target something but when you throw it you can throw it wherever you want to that's kind of interesting right hmm. 70. Okay, let's, let's, we need to limit damage as much as possible, so let's shoot this guy. Okay. And now... Do, 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 now we can... I think now what we need to do is make sure that we get damage off on the other one by throwing our Perilous Core here. 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 So this will do, like, 20 damage to him. Yep, there he is. And it pops his shell. So we got some damage off on him. It was actually 30, so it was a lot. But uh, that was the thing. We just needed to make sure to do damage. Oh, Bala. 
<laughs> it's actually pretty funny. Uh, let's see, precision flask? Eh, maybe. Let's see, what's your chance? You can't see him. Seventy percent. Yeah, we need a caber, right? I mean, that's the problem. Uh, let's see here. How much damage will you deal? Okay, so we need to use our. Yeah, okay, this is what we're gonna do. We need Zinchenko. We need a caber, right? I mean, that's the problem. Let's shoot this one. Good riddance, you beast of pestilence. And so now, uh, you can move as, get as close as you can. And now I think what we do here is we, we sneak around back to the back, and then we do a, a throw precision flask from here. So even if this misses, okay, yeah, even if this misses, we're still in good shape because it shoots my guy that can take a hit, so. There we go. Right. Now you can take a breather. Tension does nice, good job, system. pancakes. Time is it six? Yeah. Okay. Do 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 do. Oh. S uh, boom and zoom. Gain a free short move after successfully damaging an enemy. Smoke bomb. Toss a smoking flask that stealths all heroes in an area, hiding them from the cadence until they move or attack. Let's try the boom and zoom. This sounds kind of fun. And then Joshua. Uh, let's give you the honed hearing. Let's give you, yeah, let's give you the honed hearing. We do need Zinchenko. The corruption. Oh. Rignoc uh, DeVoe died heroically in battle. Um, let's see, Yuri? Nope. Arden. Mm. Dim-witted, sluggish, attuned. Alric? How about somebody, Monica? Bear strength and slow. Really? You guys are... Let's give it to, uh, Einstinct. Aaron Butterworth died. No. Um... I think... Elton? No, 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 no. We're going to give this to Christopher. Christopher has, has shown that Christopher knows what's going on. So we're going to give it to you. Okay. Whew. So I'm just going to play till the uh, till the, the start of the next battle, but I'm not going to play the next battle. Oh no! Lick Verima, Regent of Silver Lease, has died. So Pinky is pretty good. Uh, let's see. Nervous. Constance is nervous. That's pretty bad, actually. Jocelyn has arthritis, so she's out. Helicon. He Heliacon is nimble. Ooh, you're pretty good, actually. You have no negative traits. That's good. Um, Alessandra? Let's go with a... Uh, Alessandra. Let's go with Alessandra, actually, as the uh, as the regent. Or do I want Helicon? Let's do Heliacon. I like that better. Yeah. No? Yeah. It's better to have more characters. And then, ooh. Bess Folkman? That's okay. Slow and yeah, you're now. <laughs> Sorry, guy. Yeah, let's marry in. Let's marry in Bess Folkman. This is not a bad match. We've oh yes. Out something you'll Einsicht Devoe reports that an old mentor and renowned bear fighter, uh, Epin 
The walrus DeVoe has refused to evacuate his home, even with the corruption on his doorstep. Apparently, it has something to do with pride and not wanting to run away from a battle. With your blessing, Einsicht would like to go out there and bring him to the capital. Yes. Godspeed. Percival of the Sadrite Skulls has died. No. Okay. Um... Are there any of Verimas that are old-ish that would like to volunteer to be... Uh, who was it? Constance? You're pretty good. There was somebody else, though, that I thought was pretty terrible that should be retired. Yeah, Jocelyn, you're, you're clumsy and have arthritis, so you're, you're going to be retired. Come on, guys. Walrus. Walrus. It is the way to go. Walrus is love. Walrus is life. Uh, oh, hey. Arden came of age. You're okay. Let's see. And then um, William has been born. William Verima. Impressionable. Okay. I would think it's funny how you can see some of the talents or some of the traits right as they're... Right as they're uh, uh, right when they're born. Like, you have this, you know, one-month-old baby, and you're like, actually, she's pretty nimble. Bothadir Butterworth, Regent of the Churn, has died. Okay. So who is going to take up the helm? Vector? You're quite good, but you're a little on the old side. It's not bad, though. Tyler? You're even older. Um, the other option would go someone like Felton, who's bad. Matthew? Matthew's pretty good. Tra uh, bear strength and hardy is good. So let's go with you, I think. Ooh. He's a reveler. That's okay. The walrus. Indeed. Nimble? No, 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 no. Romero. You are so out. Didn't, uh... Oh, she's looking pretty good for 72. Okay, uh, Constance? No, no, no. Alessandra is okay. Arden? Hmm. None of these are particularly good, I have to say. And she has longevity, so apparently she's gonna live a while longer, too. Another 15 years or so. Average fertility. Hmm. I would like a few more Shadow Jacks, though. Let's marry in uh, Alessandra, actually. She's nimble, though. She's so good. Uh... Yeah, let's marry, in, let's marry in Alessandra. I don't love it, but I think that'll be fine. Walrus. Come on, Walrus. Colin Summerfield has died. No. That's so bad. Scorn. Okay, so our options are uh, Alina, who's faint-hearted, which might be a problem. Maya, who's okay. Irvati is awesome and nimble, but she's going to die pretty soon. I think just give it to... Um, let's give it to Maya, I think. Short-sighted, though. Let's give it to... Yeah, let's give it to Maya. Scorn. Wait, did that say it's level 10 already? That's pretty good. That's one thing about this game. I think that the, in general, you level up relics a little bit too fast. I think that it should be take longer. Oh, for God. For goodness sake. A lone figure stumbles into the throne room. Uh, Async DeVoe has pleaded emphatically with Epin, but the words fell on deaf ears. Exhausted of all other options with desperate for success, DeVoe then attempted to change his mind with force. One should have known uh, better than to move on a walrus. Or to move a walrus. Ugh, leg injury. Oh, it's so bad. Are you kidding me? You guys are jerks. This. This Vorma. You're not bad. Uh, Monica DeVoe. Bear strength and slow. Ugh, gross. Raymond Blood. Nearsighted but brainy and wily and attuned. 
Yeah, that sucks, Skull. I'm really sad about that one. Uh, that's okay. Anastasia Summerfield has died. Okay. That leg injury. Um. Yeah, let's do Eliana. Elena. Siegfried? Yeah, let's marry him in. The asthmatic is bad, but... Yeah, that's true. On the bright side, we're two-thirds of the way there. I, I think we'll make it. It's it's not per going particularly well, but it's okay. So... Um, let's get those Vitalibans going. I think that'll help a lot. I keep losing people stupidly. Um... Constance? You're brainy, unfortunately. I think we're gonna... Uh, let's see. Is everyone else that's good? 11. 42. Vector? Your bare strength, though. You're so good. Actually, let's put Charles in there. Yeah, we're not gonna marry him to anyone at this point, so we're gonna put Charles Hawkins in there. It wouldn't have been a leg injury if she had a perilous core strapped to her heart. Oh gosh, they would have both died. Yay, Vitalibans. Okay, uh, let's see. I think armor next. Let's get the uh, refined alchemist armor next, guys. I think that's probably my best, my next best bet. Confirm. My alchemists tend to be, like, especially the blood, they like getting up close, so let's go ahead and get that going. Oh no, we lost another sage right. It'll be, what, 10 years or something before that's done? Hmm. Yad? He's okay. Constance? Constance, I think we're going to retire you. I know the Varimas have a close relationship with the Sage Rites Guild, so let's do it. Oh, hey, uh, Maya Summerfield came of age. And she's a lone wolf, stalwart, and nervous. Uh, that's not quite good. But she does have a powerful relic, so that's that's on the plus side. The plus column, as it were. A ruler's work is never done. We wouldn't bring it up if it wasn't important. Uh-oh, this is awkward. A distraught man comes to you and begins uh, by saying his family lives near the corruption line. I was playing outside with my children uh, when recently when one of my daughters yells out that she sees something in the, uh, something in the curdle. Uh, uh, that's her word for the corruption. Before I could stop her, she ran in into it and I watched her age into dust. Now I accept what happened, but these are strange days and so uh, we're in, so I have to ask, is there any hope for her? I don't know, but I'll send Charles, one of my sage rites, to investigate. I don't know, but I'll send Anne, one of my heroes, uh, to investigate. No, I'm afraid not. Anne Blood, how useful are you? Um, let's see. There's no good ending to this one. Yeah, I don't think so. Um, let's see here. How about we do... Hmm. Let's send Charles. Charles is brainy, and so I think he might he might know what's going on. And now we have a vacancy. I wonder if I fill his vacancy, if someone else... Uh... Actually, yeah. Yeah, let's put you in there, too. <laughs> there we go. I wonder if he comes back as a sage right and is like, where's my spot in the sage rights guild, guys? Oh no, partner of Regent Wade Blood has died. Okay. You guys are super old, yeah. Um. Hmm. Monica? Slow. Slow. Let's give a, let's marry Iravati in there. I think you guys can be happy together for a while. Uh, yeah, the relief mission, so that that's going on. That'll be another year. Charles is off trying to find hope for a grieving father. 
triple attack. Um, ooh. That 25% reduction is not bad, but I think we're going to have to defend our keep. Um, but that'll be, uh, that won't come until tomorrow. So, yeah, thanks for hanging out, guys. I I think, yeah, let's play some, I'll play a little bit of Torbash Doom, and then we'll probably do maybe some Magicka after that. Um, but uh, give me like half an hour and then I will I'll start streaming that afterward so um, I just need to go and have some dinner I'll probably do end up doing the stir fry later on tonight and so yeah I will uh, I'll, I'll leave my I'll leave the chat on but I won't be available like you know I may not respond right away and so yeah uh, what time is it now so it's so yeah, it'll say seven o'clock. We can mess around with Tor Bash and then some Wizard Wars after that, probably. That's sort of my plan. And Agent has the uh, the sign up if you guys want to join in on the Wizard Wars. And please uh, go ahead and join the uh, Steam group, and then uh, you can add me as a friend. So. And then uh, yeah, I will see you guys in like forty minutes. And again, I'll, I'll have this. I'll get the stream going in just a bit too. So yeah, thanks for hanging out, and definitely check out my videos on YouTube if you haven't. I have all the other Massive Chalice ones up there, except for the last days, and those will be up probably tomorrow morning or maybe late tonight. So. What do you need, Agent? Oh yeah, thank you. It's also uh, it should be listed on the uh, on the Twitch page as well. Yeah, go ahead and join the group and feel free to add me. I'm one of the officers in the group. You can add me as a friend if you want to. If you want to stalk me. Anyway, yeah, thanks guys, and I will uh, hopefully see you in a little bit.